Hey guys, happy Saturday. Hope everybody's having a great day so far. I just wanted to pop on here, guys, real quick. I know some of you, including myself, um, we are getting ready for the uh, playoff games, which are pretty exciting. So um, I just wanted to get on here and actually go over uh, what happened here. Something happened here. There we go. I don't know what happened, but something happened with my video. We just went up. But anyway, this is what live Facebook is, and that's just part of the game. So anyway, so the topic for today, guys, is the uh, the gyms are getting really full again. And uh, because Emily and I are over 65, 65 and over, um, our insurance company, uh, we actually get into gyms for free. So we go to multiple different gyms in our area, probably, I think, about four or five of them. And um, all of them actually are getting full, and I'm seeing a lot of new new faces as well. And you guys know this, year after year after year, everybody makes uh, you know New Year's resolutions. They're going to get on a healthy lifestyle or lose that holiday weight or whatever. And, and what's, the sad part is that the majority of them uh, don't even get close to their goals. They quit within 30 days, 45 days. And they get frustrated because they're at first they may see the results. They may see some weight loss when they're going to the gym or they're doing the cardio every single day and lifting weights every single day. But that eventually slows down and uh, because they're not addressing the root cause. And you guys know that Emily and I, we focus or we teach about um, high good dietary fat, low carb meals and intermittent fasting. And you guys that follow me know that I really talk a lot about hormones because that's the root cause why people uh, fail, basically. Uh, like I said, they might see results at first, but they will plateau out and they don't know how to get out of those plateaus because they're not addressing the root cause. So they've always been told for years by either people or the internet or Google that you must go to the gym and you must exercise. And the truth of the matter is that's just not true. Um, I've been doing this now for over 40 years and Emma and I have been making our living at doing this. And we've learned over those years the exact reason why, including, uh, you know, we're, us too, we thought the same thing that we had to exercise and go to the gym or and go to the gym to lose that belly fat or body fat or and to add lean muscle. Now to add lean muscle, yes. Yes, you, you do. But you need to, you don't need to go to the gym. You can have your own home gym. Rubber bands work great. But what I'm trying to say here is that it's not about going to the gym. I did a video, I think, a week ago or a few day, days ago about, um, it's not about going to the gym, guys. This is your, this is your take for, for the day. And I'm sure a lot of you have heard about, uh, have heard me talk about this. You guys, it, it, you can do all the exercising you want. You can do all, you can go to, to the gym as long as you want. You can be on the best diet in the world. But if you don't address the root cause, if you don't understand the root cause, and if you don't control the root cause, then you're basically wasting your time. And that's why going to the gym, thinking by going to the gym, and exercising, you're going to lose that holiday weight you gained, or you're going to get in the best shape of your life. And that's just not true. It's all about what goes in your mouth. And it's all about how often you consume that food in your mouth. And it's all about monitoring and controlling certain hormones that are designed to gain fat for your body to gain fat and there's certain hormones that are designed to cause you to have cravings and exercising and going to the gym are not going to control those hormones it's what goes in your mouth and how how often you eat is going to do it and, and when the public and when these health professionals start educating their clients on the root cause 
that it's going to play out this way for decades longer. And most of you probably have basically done the same thing with the same results year after year after year. And so that is what I'm getting from my clients who start up with us on our weight loss program. You can go check it out at BillMaberCoaching.com. You can check out our packages and courses. And uh, <laughs> it's pretty simple because this, our program has been around for 2000 years for decades and it's always worked. It always will. It's not a fad diet. It, it, it's just, it's a way the body is designed to run off of your own stored body fat, but you guys have gotten away from it by putting yourselves on the standard American diet and on high carb meals. You're eating multiple meals a day and they're high carbs. You're not even dipping into your own stored body fat. You're just doing what everybody else is doing. And so with us, when we keep, when we work with our clients, we switch them from that. We switch them from burning carbs as their primary fuel source to burning fat. And that's the key factor on how you're going to control those hormones that are causing those sweet cravings and those hormones that are causing you to be a type two diabetic and why you can't re reverse it and the medication is not going to work. So guys, just here, this is your take for the day. Just know that going to the gym and exercising isn't going to take that fat weight off for long term or for the rest of life unless you understand uh, the root cause. And so by going to BillMaberryCoaching.com, hit the free consultation button. Let's talk about your concerns and let's talk about how to solve those, those concerns. And if you're a busy mom and dad and you work a 40 hour work week and you gotta come home and take care of kids at the same time, you guys just don't have time to go to the gym. You don't even, most of you don't have time exercising. Well, our weight loss program, which I said, I'll say it again, it's over 2000 years old, will actually help you to lose weight even though you can't exercise. I've done it in the past, I've been doing it for years. And there's a lot of seniors I've worked with that have physical uh, issues that can't exercise and we've been able to get 40, 50, 60 pounds off them in a short amount of time just by addressing the hormones that are causing the issues. Okay, guys? So, guys, enjoy the games today, and I will see you guys at the next video. Have a great day.